Tanner Fritz is going to draw a penalty, but now he holds the puck behind the Minnesota net. Weaving and winding his way below the goal line. From outside, he hits Clark Christoffoli. Now a one-time opportunity from Weiss. In front, there's Johnson, he scores! A little crease crashing down below from Ohio State's Matt Johnson. And he draws even here in Value City Arena. 11.53 remaining in the second period, and it is now a 2-2 game. Matt Johnson with his first goal in four games in his 13th of the season. Buckeyes move right to left here on the power play in the first of the evening for them. Nick Schilke has it below the left circle, comes out high, does a little spin at the top of the circle, fired at the left point. There's one that was tossed in toward the net. Liz Johnson scores! Anthony Greco from the right circle, comes up left point, Jardine now along for Schilke, right back to Greco, advanced in front, they score! Tanner Fritz, nice little tic-tac-toe, and the Buckeyes make it 2-1 here. Just about a minute and 20 seconds into the second period. A little right circle feed for Angeli, didn't connect. Now McLean hammers one from the left point that hits a shin pad. Now loose in front, there's Angeli trying to stass it, loose puck, they score! Nick Schilke fighting the back of the net on a rebound. And he will make it a 1-0 game with 11.06 remaining in the opening period for Schilke. That's his ninth of the season. What a little scramble play there. Angeli catches a pass. Has a lot of time in front of the net. Tries to go forehand, backhand on Wilcox. Wilcox makes a great save off the left leg pad. But as a result, the puck comes right outside the blue paint. The Schilke's there coming into the play. And he just backhands it high over the blocker of Wilcox, who was just kind of scrambling to get back into position. And the Buckeyes make it a 1-0 game. Pass up ahead. Now Sam Warning grabs it with no one on him in the left circle. Has a pass across. Finds it. Shot. Save made. Oh, what a stop by Steve Racine. Holy smokes. Steve Racine hits in the way of the puck. How about that? Sam Warning comes in at the left circle. It's effectively a two on O because Justin Selman was out of the play. And so he tosses it right through to the slot. And there's Travis Boyd on the back end waiting for it. Steve Racine, oh man, completely outstretched, throws up the glove hand, pulls it down, and he has something in there. 3.30 left in regulation. Buckeyes leading 3-2. Iowa State will make defensive changes here with Josh Healy and Craig Dalrymple back on D. Lundy to take the draw off the blocker side of Adam Wilcox. Justin Kluse wins this for Minnesota, and he will pick it up below his own right circle before coming up the far wall. Onto the stick of Taylor Camerata, tapped on toward Letary. Buckeyes steal it away. Craig Dalrymple mixed up with the official behind the Ohio State net, and Justin Kluse is in as well. Tyler Lundy trying to pry it free. Kluse comes away with it to the point. And there's a shot from Brodzinski that didn't get through high in the zone. And the Buckeyes' Luke Stork has it. Off the left side of the center logo. Now he gains his zone. Stork from the left circle. That hit a body in front and caromed all the way through the neutral zone where Justin Kluse has it for Minnesota. Out wide to the left side. Camerata stretch feed there. Save made by Christian Fry as he holds his shoulder against the post and keeps it out. Back the other way. Move the Buckeyes. Johnson hustling onto a loose puck. But Wilcox comes out of the faceoff circle to clear that away. 2.40 left in the third period. Buckeyes lead 3-2. Travis Boyd angling on through into the Buckeyes offensive end. Puts a heavy check into Justin De Silva. That puck will spring free to Ohio State's Tanner Fritz, who has it now on the defensive end. Under 2.30 to play now in regulation. Buckeyes Fritz into the offensive end off the glove side of Wilcox. Tied up by Bischoff. Mike Riley takes this puck away for Minnesota, and he will step on through to the neutral zone. Up ahead to Sam Warning. Now it's Travis Boyd. Holds it top of the left circle, gets this one low below the goal line. And now Josh Healy involved with Sam Warning. Riley gets this puck up at the point for Travis Boyd. Moves between the circles now. Gets it wide to Riley. Fires one through on Fry that he tracked all the way, and he holds on to. 23rd shot of the game here for Minnesota. Fry's been outstanding. He has 21 saves. Buckeyes lead 3-2 with 1.53 left in regulation. Faceoff will come off the glove side of Fry. Buckeyes will put out the line of Amsley, Schilke, and Weiss with Jardine and McLean back on D. It'll be Leon Brisdett, Kyle Rao, Hudson Fashion. 
Out for Minnesota, back on D, Mike Riley and Jake Bischoff, but now a timeout called by Minnesota coach Don Lucia. Faceoff will come off the glove side of Fry. It'll be Ambrose, Boyd, and Warning. Out for Minnesota, they make defensive changes after that, rather offensive changes after that timeout. Angeli to take the draw against Boyd. And Angeli wins this back. So the Buckeyes' Craig Dalrymple comes up the near wall to Nick Schilke, who just lifts the backhand through the neutral zone. And Ohio State can't settle this down, so Kyle Rao has it, but he gives it away to Weiss now with an empty net for Minnesota. Weiss holds on, fires it, just goes wide of the goal. Six skaters on here for the Golden Gophers. Mike Riley trying to step through the neutral zone. Cut off by Angeli, he fired one wide of the goal. Now here's Weiss with it in the offensive end. And his shot toward the net, again deflected wide. Travis Boyd in behind the Minnesota net with Mike Riley. He fakes the step out on the right side, comes on the left now through the neutral zone. It's Hudson Fashing. Fashing stepping into the blocker side of Christian Fry. Buckeyes lead 3-2 with a minute five remaining. Tanner Fritz through the neutral zone for Ohio State. Off the right wing side. Nothing but nylon. Buckeyes make it 4-2. One oh two remaining in the third period. And Tanner Fritz stepping in off the right side. He has a clean shot on net, but he feeds it off to Anthony Greco just to be sure. And Greco with an easy tap-in goal. And the Buckeyes take a two-goal advantage against number 15, Minnesota.